Hi, folks, nice from HighOnAndroid.com, where we get on Android every day. Anyway, I've been getting a lot of questions like, Hey, Max, how do you install LG G3 Keyboard on my Android device? Um, so, I did install LG G3 Keyboard on a bunch of my devices, like the OnePlus One here. Let me go show you how to do this. It's pretty easy, so long as you have Jelly Bean or KitKat running. Uh, with Root, a Root Android device, you can easily install this LG G3 Keyboard, uh, which you can also resize. Let's go ahead and take a look, and let's go install it together. Let's go do this, baby. So let me go ahead and show you the LG G3 Keyboard. I really like it because it's sort of like AOSP, uh, but I really like it. You know, also you can do swipe uh, if you want to. Um, so it's a very nice keyboard. Now the coolest thing about this keyboard is that you can actually resize uh, the keyboard. And you can find that in settings, language, and inputs. And here uh, you'll be able to change the keyboard layout and the height. Uh, I think this makes total sense for those of you with small fingers uh, or for those of you who have hard, typing, hard time typing. Um, this is going to definitely help you. My favorite height is about just about there. But let me go ahead and show you how to install it on any Android device, uh, rooted Android device running Android uh, Jelly Bean or KitKat. So any of the latest phones or if you're running any of the latest uh, custom ROMs. I'm going to be using my OnePlus One here. Um, so the first thing you'll need to do is go and download this file. I'll have a direct link to it, but uh, if you're following this on your phone, then you can simply go to download Android ROM. Uh, dot com here and go ahead and scroll down to APK and go ahead and um, press on APK there and then go ahead and press on the keyboard all right and here you'll find LG G3 keyboard port dot APK all right and go ahead and wait like five seconds and enter the captcha to download and once it's downloaded uh, this is an app that will actually install it uh, it's not the actual keyboard oh it is an actual keyboard but it will install it for you uh, peak day pricing ah. all right this will download download should take about a second or two since this is a small file uh, if you get this error uh, a warning sign that it can harm just say yes it's not gonna harm your device um, so that is downloading and uh, actually it's gonna take a little bit longer I'll be back when this is done downloading all right that took another minute or two I'm gonna go ahead and click on the APK file if you get a uh, can't open file um, you can go ahead and use a file explorer app all right, you can grab the ES file explorer app um, just in case you don't have a file explorer or you can use my files uh, if you have a Samsung phone and also if you have a CM11 ROM, there's a file manager app. Um, there are some times where you install custom ROMs, you don't have a file explorer. Actually, I really like this one the best, ES File Explorer. Go ahead and open and go into your download folder and try to open it. And it should open and you should be able to install it. Oh, there we go. There's the LG G3 keyboard port.apk. Uh, if it says install block, go into settings and make sure unknown source is checked on. And then hit the back button and try to install it again and finally we'll be able to install it hit install accept all right and also you do have busybox uh, you do have to have busybox installed um so just in case uh you make sure you have a busybox installed and of course you should have your phone rooted if you don't have a rooted phone um you will actually need to root it all right and sometimes when you root, a BusyBox is not installed by default. So go ahead and install BusyBox just in case uh, your phone doesn't have BusyBox. This will allow you to check if you already have BusyBox or not. And it should say BusyBox 1.22.1 uh, is installed. So I don't have to reinstall it. Uh, but if it does, if it says you, it's not installed, go ahead and hit the install button and install it. And then finally, we'll go into uh, the app we install which is the LG G3 keyboard app here all right and um, say okay all right and make sure you hit uh, allow or grant for when super user requests window pops up all right you can go ahead and back up your current uh, keyboard files so if something goes wrong you can go ahead and go back into it and restore all right and then go ahead and hit install and this will install the LG G3 keyboard. And the reason why you can't just install the LG G3 APK files uh, straight on there because it's not compatible 
Um, so this app allows you to install on any Android device. So give it a second here. And it should say it's done when it's done. Ah. All right, I don't know what happened there, but I'm gonna go ahead and try to do a force close. Uh, or I'm just gonna kill all the apps and I'm gonna try to install it again. Oh, okay, it said, it said uh, installation complete. I, had, I just had to wait a little bit, so I wasn't impatient. I was impatient, I wasn't patient enough. There we go, reboot, and I will be back when this reboots. Actually, I'll stay on here. Uh, by the way, I'm running Jedi ROM. This is uh, the same developer. A PTMR3 used to make the Jedi ROMs uh, for, I think, the Note 2. Um, he didn't make one for Note 3. He made one uh, for, he started with the T989, the T-Mobile G2. Um, it's got really cool stuff like, uh, what is that? Uh, all the Star Wars stuff, like you get the uh, lightsaber sounds when you took the S Pen out with the Note 2. Uh, it was a really cool ROM. But now he's moving on to OnePlus One, so you should find the same stuff here. Oh, this is version 1.0. All right, uh, once that's done, you're gonna have to actually uh, go into settings and change your keyboard settings. So let me go into keyboard here, go to language and input in settings, and go ahead and choose LG keyboard like that, and change the default keyboard to LG, G, LG keyboard. All right, go ahead and open up a browser and go ahead and try to type. Now you have uh, LG keyboard, cool, all right. Um, so now the keyboard is really small. Now this keyboard is great for one, a big phone like OnePlus One because you can resize it uh, any way you like. So go back into settings and go back into uh, language and input and go into the settings for LG G3 keyboard. It's gonna ask you to change uh, the height. Say yes, next. And now you can go ahead and resize it. Uh, I'm gonna make it just a little bit there. Perfect right there. I really love this keyboard. And now you'll be able to enjoy uh, LG G3 keyboard. And this should work on any Android device, even tablets, um, so long as you have Jelly Bean or KitKat. But you do have to have a root installed. Uh, anyway, that was how to install the LG keyboard on your uh, and root and Android device. Ah. Going, going to com com. And thanks for watching this video. As you can see, you can go ahead and install the LG G keyboard on any Android smartphone or tablet device. And don't forget to donate to the developer of this installation application. I'll have the donate links on my site. And as always, stay on Android.